Hello, I hope you are having a wonderful day. Today I wanted to talk a little bit about big ideas in a story. So you can look for big ideas, but first what is a big idea? So a big idea is a universal topic related to a text. An example of that is going to be like love, friendship, power, ambition, family. Uh, The list goes on and on. Uh, Many, many, many things can be big ideas. Big ideas are going to be nouns. So, like, love is a noun. It's a thing. It's an idea. Um, And that's what we're going for when we're looking for big ideas. Big ideas are going to help us think about theme. They're going to help us analyze, like, why a story exists or, like, what it's trying to tell us. Uh, And going to help us kind of sum up some of the main interesting things in the books that we read. So big ideas are a really important thing. They're a really interesting thing and they're a really good place to start. Uh, Big ideas are also something really interesting to discuss um, with book clubs. So noticing them can also lead to really good discussions. So in order to find them, we want to look at conflict and pressures. We want to think about real world topics that we've noticed and we want to notice mirrors and state them as one word ideas. We could also notice windows and state them as one word ideas. Um, But all of those kind of things we've been doing with pressures, conflicts, identity, things like that, those will all get us to some big ideas. So if we think about Tia Issa wants a car, we can think about the different let's choose a different color we can think about some of these things and put some big ideas down for Tia Issa wants a car so if you remember in that story Tia Issa wanted a car and our narrator helped save money and they ended up getting the car fabulous right so if we think about this we can kind of think about the conflict or pressure so like one of the big conflicts right was that they didn't have enough money to get the car. So money could be a big idea in the story Tia Issa wants a car. Money is obviously a physical item sometimes, but it's also an idea, right? Um, Another one, another conflict was like they couldn't get anywhere they wanted to go. So they were sort of like trapped or like not free to do whatever they wanted. So we could think like maybe freedom. Another one of the conflicts or pressures was that their family was far away, right? So family could be a big idea in Tia Issa wants a car. Uh, We talked about those real world topics. This is related to money. But we talked about poverty and class, which are big ideas. We talked about immigration which is a big idea. And we can notice mirrors and state them as one word ideas or windows. Um, Mirrors tend to be easier for us to see. So that's why I put mirrors there. Um, So things like with family, I noticed how loving the family was. So love could maybe be a big idea in TA Issa wants a car. Um, Because I had that mirror where my family is very loving and the family in the story was very loving. Um, So, see how easy that is to just think of some of those big ideas and just kind of list them as a one word big idea. Um, Then we could go and say, like, well, what does Tia Issa wants a car say about freedom? What does it say about money? What does it say about family? What does it say about immigration? Um, And we could talk more about that. And that would be a really interesting place to discuss and a really interesting place to start some writing uh, and some other things. So take a few moments and really think about some of the big ideas in your memoir so far see what you can come up with you might want to jot this down in your regular jots next week we'll do a little wrap up where we talk about some of these things as we learn a little bit about theme and wrap some stuff up all right have a fabulous day